Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football, perfect playing conditions. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary box, providing expert analysis, is Stuart. And coming up for you is live action from Major League Soccer. It's Los Angeles FC, and they take on the San Jose Earthquakes. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. And so the LAFC starting 11. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. And introducing the visitors lineup today. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. And they kick off here. Eduardo Lopez. Ewell. Abecassis. And the cross is very much on. And the keeper won't be complaining about that cross. Poor quality. Well, he always seems to offer that something extra when it's required, Carlos Vela. Stuart, in your opinion, what will he offer today? Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute is his ability to combine with teammates, particularly in tight areas, in and around the box, clever little one-twos, little passes around the corner. He's the player that could be key to breaking down this defence. And no way through. And Lopez. Well, pressing really high. And take it away. Espinosa. Ewell. Jutson. Oh, that's a fine pass. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. Just wasn't a very good pass, finally. So it's going to be a goal kick here. Murillo. And intercepted it. Throw ins given. Space and time for the cross. Well, that's not textbook defending. Still not clear. Dangerous looking attack. This looks promising. Laid into the centre. Well, the clearance half hearted. And running through to the keeper.
Moving it forward. Abekasis. Crossing opportunity. Foiling them effectively. Lovely ball over the top. Well, that is how to run at defenders. Brian Rodriguez. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. And the keeper showing tremendous command. Well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it? Short corner it is. Blessing. Murillo. Is this the moment? Can't miss, surely. And the keeper flings himself at the ball. It's a short corner. Can they get in behind them? Vela. Happy to take on the shot. There it is! The first goal in the derby! A special moment! Well, just look at this. It's a good finish and reward for their pressure. They really have controlled this game. be one minute added on at the end a chance then for the respective managers to address their charges it is half time here well plenty to like about what Carlos Vela offered in the first half interested to get your assessment well I'm sure the manager will be delighted with him he'll have drilled it into them to keep their focus keep playing through to the half time whistle and it's certainly put them in a good position to go on and win this now Two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Espinosa. Jutson. Ewell. Jutson. a cul-de-sac in terms of the attack counter-attacking very much an option Vela chance here and he clears it out of harm's way Vela, superb block. And successfully cut out. Crisp tackling.
has plenty of know-how in the ball shielding department insufficient guile on the crossing front you've got to say in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here how about the cross moving the ball nicely looking for that final pass fine cross into the middle well the header was respectable but the goalkeeper always seemed to have it covered So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Number 11, Jose Cifuentes, to be replaced by Number 8, Francisco Guinella. Substitution for San Jose Earthquakes. Leaving the match, Number 44, Cade Powell. Entering the match, Number 8, Chris Wondolowski. Promising attack, this. Chance to cross. Great opportunity. And he scored not once, but twice. They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Well, here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer. But you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post cover for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. Well, a second goal for them here. Ewell, wonderfully weighted pass, but it comes to nothing in the end, offside. Well, he doesn't need to make his movement quite so quickly there. Just let the ball be played into the space. And with play stop, they will make the change now. Number 17, Brian Rodriguez. Well, as you can see, the hosts have controlled the possession, and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly. Their pressing has been excellent, and they just haven't stopped working. It's been a fantastic performance up to oh, now. Oh, sorry, Stuart, look at this. No way through. Not a harmless effort when all is said and done. Here it is now, a substitution. Well, on the cusp of the final whistle and the home side really prospering today. Stuart, interested to get your take. Yeah, clearly the better side. Obviously being fantastic up front, but it's their work ethic for me. They're just not happy unless they have the ball and they're fighting to win it back whenever they do lose it. It's been a really great performance all round. Just the challenge that was required. And five minutes to go. And intercepted it. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Well, he stopped them just when they looked menacing. That's high level goalkeeping. Well, that's a fantastic save. He's such a good keeper.
So making the substitution now. Coming off the pitch, number 14, Jackson Ewell, to be replaced by number 11, Jeremy Ibovisi. Over it comes. And there it is, the final whistle. The home fans are going to be happy with this result. Well, Derek, it was a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today. Well, it was a fantastic performance from Carlos Vela. Stuart, as always, interested to get your assessment. What caught your eye above all else? Well, he looked a top-class player today. Every time he touched the ball, he was a threat. And he worked so hard for the team as well. What a good display that was.